This is Twit. I think we've mentioned this. Uh, it's certainly been all over the news in the last uh, couple of weeks. The the 40th anniversary 8086, uh, which would be the Core i7 8086K, K for overclockable, uh, is official. Six cores, five gigahertz, Coffee Lake, 14 nanometer, uh, plus plus process. Um, you know, it's... Uh, it's uh, a lot like an 8700K, but just uh -huh. a smidge faster. I mean, it's four. Uh -huh. it, it, it feels like I, I feel a bin sorting operation going on here because it's four gigahertz up from the 3.7 gigahertz uh, base clock on the 8700K, five gigahertz turbo clock up from the 4.7 gigahertz turbo clock on the 8700K, 12 megabytes of cache, DDR4 2666, 16 PCI lanes, 95 watts, LGA 1150. You know, whatever sockets. Uh, what we don't know at this point is that uh, uh, what the price is going to be. Personally, I think Intel should give them out for you know, actually not you know, eighty eighty six prices because they were kind of terrifying for what you got. <laughs> uh, looking at them in yeah. hindsight, but um, it was an eighty eighty six extraordinary processor when it came out. Uh, do you think it's going to be more than the three hundred forty nine dollars? Uh, for the A700K or less? I would assume more. Oh, no. I, I think it has to be more. Um, it's a limited edition. 50,000 of them are going to be made. They're going to give away 8,086 of them for a sweepstakes, which uh, I think... And actually, you need to pay attention to this because it starts in four hours, the sweepstakes mm -hmm. does, as we're recording this, and you only have 24 hours to enter. So if you're listening to this and it's not live, you should absolutely be going to, I think it's, it's game.intel.com slash 8086 sweepstakes. Um, and there you can enter a chance to win. I don't know how much it's going to cost. They they list in the, um, in the terms and conditions that the value is approximately $425. So... Uh, my guess is that the retail price on this would be four twenty five, <laughs> um, <clears throat> but because it's limited edition, you don't know what the resellers are going to do. You don't know how much they might jack up the price. Right. But you know, it's three hundred megahertz on your base clock, three hundred megahertz on your boost clock. It's not a huge number. Chances are, if you try real hard, you could get that overclock yourself. Um, right. But it's a five gigahertz mark. It's it's just kind of like the cachet of having they they sold a processor. That uh, that could hit five gigahertz on it, which is which is pretty neat. Um, and uh, you're, you're excited. 50, I can feel it in your voice. It it is like I you know having all the rumors of this coming out and and then eventually confirming it. My mm -hmm. our our original goal was like okay, we're rebuilding our GPU test bed. That would be the perfect processor to use for that because it's the fastest sure. single threaded part you can get. However, because of its limited edition nature and not knowing if we'll be able to get replacements if something goes wrong mm -hmm. and or you know. The average consumer may not be able to build a system to duplicate right. our results. We decided to maybe go back to the 8700K instead. 